Now, Amazon has decided to no longer sell Chinese goods in China. Yes, you heard that right. It's shutting down a part of its China operations, meaning Amazon is not operating its local Chinese website. And from now on, it will only be selling overseas goods to the Chinese consumer. So why is the world's largest online retailer retreating from the dragon? Our next report answers that question for you. Amazon's ambitious China foray has failed to take off. And now the company will be shutting its flagship online retail business, Amazon.cn, in the country by the 18th of July this year. Amazon has notified its sellers that it will no longer operate a marketplace nor provide seller services on Amazon.cn. Amazon customers in the country will not be able to buy goods from Chinese merchants. Amazon did not explain why it was withdrawing its marketplace service. Instead, it spoke about how the focus will now shift to other lucrative businesses, like selling overseas goods and internet-based cloud services. It is set to continue its Amazon Global Store, selling Kindle e-readers and online content. People in China will continue to enjoy Amazon's web services and cloud data storage. Chinese consumers will be able to order products from the United States, Britain, Germany and Japan, but only after paying extra charges. It's a clear sign that the world's largest online retailer is struggling. That too in a country which has the biggest middle class consumer base in the world. Amazon first entered the Chinese market 15 years ago when it acquired an online book retailer. Amazon bought shopping website joyo.com in 2004 for $75 million and renamed it as Amazon China in the year 2011. But competition from domestic giants like Alibaba, JD.com and others had made life extremely difficult for Amazon. So much so that it only has a minuscule share of China's e-commerce market even now. Consumer research firm iResearch Global reported that Alibaba's Tmall marketplace and JD.com served 82% of this lucrative market last year. And newcomer Pin Duo Duo has managed to garner much of the rest of the market. Just to put it in perspective, China's online retail market notches up about $2 trillion in sales annually. Alibaba's annual online spending blitz in China regularly racks up bigger sales than Black Friday and Cyber Monday combined in the US. While the Chinese pie is certainly humongous, Amazon gets only a teeny tiny bite of it. Unlike neighboring India, where it is the dominant player. But it's not exactly the end of Amazon's China story. The American giant has over the years attracted waves of cross-border sellers, many of whom have hailed from China's traditional export industry. And of late, people in China have developed a big craving for imported goods. Middle-class consumers are now demanding higher quality products. And that's the trend that Amazon is now looking to capture. Lastly, China remains the largest market for the Amazon Kindle, so pivotal that the e-reader launched a localized model just for China. Bureau Report, Weon, World is One.